Natalie has literally been gone for hours. Bro, what? 20 min 20 minutes ago. What? Hi. Um What's up, Neasy Gang? So I guess I have some explaining to do. And <laughs> I mean, of course I'm going to. Um, I'm actually gonna put this suitcase in my trunk real quick and then we'll get into the video. Um, but before we do that, guys, if you are new to this channel, make sure you guys subscribe, turn those post notifications on because we do post notification shout outs in every single video. And um, yeah, follow us on all of our social media platforms. Um, so I'm gonna explain to you guys what happened in a minute. Let me, I'll be right back. All right, um, <laughs> I honestly can't believe that I have to film this. This seems a little over the top, but um, right now I am on my way to Easy's house. She, <laughs> I don't know if you guys, I don't know, whatever. Let's just say this, she's crazy. Like my best friend, is insane um she has been literally blowing me up playing inspector gadget like sending me millions of messages like i wish i wasn't driving right now so i could scroll and show you how many text messages and missed phone calls that i have from her like it's crazy um and I, I'm sure that you guys at this point are also wondering like, you know, well, what's going on? What were you doing? Where were you at? And I'm sure you guys are wondering, you know, who's this mystery guy? Which I would be wondering too, but I, I really didn't think that this was gonna go as far as it did. I didn't think that I was gonna be explaining myself to, you know, I guess my best friend and especially you guys this this is just crazy but I want to actually explain myself to you and her at the same time so like I said guys I'm driving there right now um, and I'm gonna explain everything in detail so I know that you guys are like what the heck hurry up and tell us but like I said I think it's important to tell you guys at the same time so please don't be mad at me um you guys just have to wait a little bit longer so that i can i guess break the news to everyone at the same time uh, so i'll see you guys when i get to the house <laughs> guys i don't know why i feel like i've been being bad and like you know like i ran away or something and i'm coming back home and my mom's about to whoop me that's that's literally how i feel right now I do not want to go in there right now. I'm here, but I'm just gonna <laughs> go back to my car. Um, but if I go missing, Neasy Gang, y'all know what happened. Y'all know who did it. All right. I don't want y'all, you know, I know she part of the Neasy Gang too. You know what I mean? But <laughs> don't let that happen. What is right is right. And what is wrong is wrong. <sighs> Hi. What up? What's up? How are you? I'm good. You mad at me? You know. You know. You're not even nervous. What? You tripping? You now, tripping, tripping? Now you know I'm not tripping. What? Now you know that I'm not tripping. <laughs> I don't, I don't get why you trying to have this camera out so you can justify why you ignore me. Like, tell, tell them, tell me, I am, please. I like, am about to tell you. Right. <laughs> I'm just going to be 100. Like, where were you? Who were you with? And like, were they that important for you to ignore your best friend? Like, I would never do that to you. I have never done that to you. And I feel like throughout our friendship, like I thought we had a better like relationship than that. You know what I'm saying? Especially cause I'm over here worried about you. So you got me scared, you got me nervous. And it's just like, dang bro. Like, and the fact that you posting, like what? Like, how are you gonna post on social media and really giving me the ultimate curve? Like, damn, like, I really thought we had a better friendship than that best friend. Like, like, 
really did. I really did. Straight up. I'm sorry. I mean, I, okay, you're sorry, but it's just like, a sorry, that's not going to make me feel better. After, you know what I'm saying? Like, you really dissed me, like, curved me, like, through a whole, you know, curveball, bro. I just feel like, what did I do? Like, why are I you mean, what's, what, what are you so mad about? Are you mad that I ignored you? Or are you mad that we were supposed to do a mukbang and I didn't come back to do it? Like Overall, everything. Like, you ignored me. You ignored me. That was the overall. Like, okay, maybe she's upset with me or maybe she just needs some space. You know, we've been together this whole time. So I'm just trying to think of every excuse for you because I know you're not like this. And it's just like, when I call you, literally you posted a video or a Snapchat of you, what? I think it was like uh, eating soup or something like that. A couple that was min- some bomb soup. So you don't even care, huh? I'm just saying, I was having flashbacks. Alright, so let me just explain what happened. Alright. What happened? I'm about to get there. Like, what's up? Like, bro, like, you going I mean, to- dang, you I'm- acting like I'm in trouble or something. Like, you're my man. Well, clearly, I'm not your man, you know. And whoever that was on your picture, like, you weren't even bold enough to show him. So, obviously, <laughs> he don't mean that much to you anyway. But I'm not acting like your man. I'm acting like a concerned friend, and as I should, you know. Yeah. Oh, you so cute when you mad. That's not funny. <laughs> Alright, I know, I know. I shouldn't, you know, I should have um told you what was going on. Period. Um, I definitely shouldn't have let this go on for this long. I feel really bad at this point because I see how much it hurt you and I nothing that I did was meant to hurt you. So what it what was it then like I don't know. It I don't know. Alright, let me just let me just explain. So basically, you know, I'm I did have every intention of just going home. Okay. You know, when I told you... Okay, good. I'm getting there. Um, When I told you I was going home to get clothes, I really was. I wasn't lying about that. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, once I got home, um, the, the plan kind of changed. And, you know, sometimes when you're tired, like, you just don't really... You know, you don't expect it. Sometimes it just hits you. Mm -hmm. You know, that's happened to you before, right? You you get, like, super tired out of nowhere. So, I fell asleep at my apartment. I fell asleep. You did not fall asleep now. I've seen your Snapchat. Come on, don't lie. Let me explain. Hold up. Okay. Come on. on. Slow your horses. Okay? Let me me get there. So, I fell asleep. What, you fell asleep for two days? No, I'm about to get. I'm about to get there. I am. All right, so I fell asleep, and you were literally blowing me up, like back to back, blowing me up. I mean, I was concerned. Like you, my you, my best friend. I know, but I was like, whoa, there. And then I'm reading my messages, and you talking about, yo, how are you gonna be like acting like so um, childish and stuff like that when when we're under quarantine you acting real like hypocritical because you won't ever let me go get food and that I mean and I was just I was a little upset I was, I, I know I saw I shouldn't have called you hypocritical and so I'm like I'm literally like what is she talking about but so, that doesn't make so, up for anything wait time. let me hey do you want to know what happened or you want to just keep talking okay I just want to say right now that I do apologize on my end I shouldn't have came at you like that because you know when you're looking for your friend it's just like you know you just start like just saying stuff out of anger okay, yeah I know uh, anyway yeah, so I'm like what is she talking about I'm like what, what, what the heck's going on so I'm like then I remember that I have posted a throwback Thursday picture of soup that I got like two months ago on my story what i was just in the mood for some tomato soup that was it so i posted it on my story wait a minute okay all right so what about what about what you was uh what, what was after that you had dessert what oh you wanted to just so happen to post the dessert too and then with the guy like bro that's bs now you really try to find a way out of this keep it 100 keep it 100 i'm not i swear to you so the soup was innocent. The rest of it was trying to mess with you. 
I'm not gonna lie because you just first of all I no. I disappeared for an hour for I disappeared for a couple hours because I was taking a cool little power nap, bro. And all of a sudden I'm getting blown up. Oh my god! Shut up! <laughs> accused of stuff. So I was like, you know what? I, this is the perfect opportunity to mess with her. I never expected that I was going to wake up to all these text messages, voicemails. I mean, you crazy, crazy. I love you, best friend, but you crazy. I'm crazy for you. <laughs> like, you know, it, it, it makes sense, though. I thought so, something could have happened to your ass could have got kidnapped. You know what I'm saying? Okay, but the fact that you were, all right, that, that's not the type of concern you were having. I mean, you, were, you were scared I was out there having a good time without you. That is exactly how you're acting. <laughs> no lie, exactly, that's how I was, bro. Exactly. I was like, oh, she eat it out. Like, I want oh, some tomato soup. I want some. How she not going to invite me? How you not going to invite me? What did I do? <laughs> so I'm over here trying to make excuses for you. Like, oh, okay. But then I see you post it. Wait, wait a minute. What about old boy? Girl, that was just to add a little juiciness into the situation. I, that ain't even me. I don't know who that is. I swear, bro. I swear. I screenshot it. I'm like, I know you're, I know you. I know you. I, I know you know screenshot it. it. You sent it to me. I'm like, yeah, you could have just told me you were talking to somebody. I'm like, yo, this is too easy. This Bruh. is too easy, easy. Yo, she, yo. Oh, and she got curly hair. Y'all, y'all have to see this, bro. Like, really, let me focus in on this, bro. I really thought that was you. I First really of all, that's- you can't tell that that's not my body. Like, that girl looks slimmer than me. Her skin complexion is a little darker than mine. Yeah. I mean, I guess if you were, you know, acting crazy and stuff, I you know, you were crazy. you were I a little, and you were kind of, like, out of your mind. So yeah. you didn't <laughs> realize that that was not me. Bruh, I'm so upset. You get on my nerves. Oh, my bro. God. Guys, did I get her or what? Did I get her or what? Why you had to drag it on for so long then? <laughs> because that was the fun part. <laughs> what does this teach you guys? All right. But I was so mad. Like, I wanted to have fun too. Like, <laughs> I was jealous. Yo, she had FOMO. All right. If y'all don't know what that is, she had the case of FOMO. Fear of missing out. Yeah, definitely. She was definitely ripping. <laughs> I was like, girl, you know. I'm waiting for this quarantine to be over so we can go enjoy some mm, crab legs or something Ooh. together. That's all we've been talking about, y'all, is crab legs. Drunken crab. Drunk- oh, oh, I can't wait to get some drunken crab. Oh, my God. All right, y'all. So make sure y'all follow us on Instagram. Subscribe to us. Join the Neasy Gang. Turn those post notifications on. And we out.